Hello friends and welcome to the next and the most anticipated episode of Travel Tech. Now this is going to be a sort of a double dhamaka for all of you because I am going to be bringing about the downloading and the installation process of both the most awaited videos of all time. The visualization app for Digipad and also the digital display for Digipad. Now both the, the downloading and the installation of app of those apps will be covered in this video so that you guys can go ahead and enjoy downloading and installing them on your digipad in this weekend so let's hope you love this as much as i loved it uh, using it in my digipad so let's just go ahead and let's get started with our video So friends, before I go ahead and show you how to download and install both the apps in the Digipad, I have two very small requests from you guys and one of those requests and the first request is that once you download this and once you install this in your Digipad, make sure you take some photographs or you take some small videos and put them in the WhatsApp groups or the Facebook groups so that everyone else who has not found out this yet does get to find out uh, from this, does get to find out about this from you and even can use this in his or her digipad so make sure you take some photographs or preferably take some videos of this visualization or also the digital speedometer display and put them in uh, all the facebook groups and the whatsapp groups whichever you are involved in of your respective car so that you can share it with everyone else so that those who have still not found out about it do get to find out and we can share this good thing among all of us so that is one small request make sure you do that and the second even smaller request is uh, because i have been bringing this apps for you and i hope you are loving them and i hope you'll also love them once you once you install it in your cars so once you install it and start using it in your car and you feel good about it just head back to my channel and uh, comment on this particular video the three small words i love travel tech so if you it would be great if you comment that below the uh, this video exactly and uh, just write in the three words i love travel tech and along with that if you want to write something more other than that you can continue writing just below those three words and i'll be listening to all of your comments so those two things i hope you guys will do just go ahead and share some videos and photos of the apps once you install them in your digipad and of course go back to this video and go to the comment section and write down the comment as i love travel tech so that will show me how much you love travel tech how much you love the apps which i'm sharing with you and that will encourage me to bring more and more interesting content for our car so i want to thank you all for the immense response and the immense love you have given me from the past one week since the time i shared the visualization app and also yesterday of course when i shared the digital display app you i know you guys have been waiting a lot and even i couldn't wait a lot so i am bringing you the installation and the downloading process of the entire apps of both the apps all together and so this will be a double the marker video for you guys so let's just go ahead and start with the exact procedure so first i'll begin with the downloading of the visualization app for the digipad the visualization which you are seeing on your screen right now will be available in your digipads from today and uh, now i'll start ahead first with the visualization app downloading process so in order to download and install the visualization app <clears throat> the first thing uh, you need to know is that there are two methods you can do that one thing is that you can download the app to your smartphone and then sideload it to the, to the digipad via your pen drive or your sd card but i think that's a cumbersome process that's a time consuming process i don't prefer that way but you can also do that you can sideload it along with your smartphone or your laptop so if you want but if you want to download the app directly to the digipad without any hassle and install it directly then i'll show you that process exactly how that works out so in order to do do that the first thing which you need to do is you need to have the firefox browser in your digipad so once you have the firefox browser that will help you download the apps which i'm showing you today and the apps which i'm going to be showing you in the future as well so make sure you have the firefox browser in your digipad so if you don't have the firefox browser or uh, you don't know how to install the firefox browser i'll just leave a link right here on top of the description of this video so just click on this link you will get to know how to find out how to install the firefox browser in your digipad so once you install this firefox browser it is going to be very easy 
uh, from now onwards to download and install the apps directly onto your digipad uh, why i am telling you to install the firefox browser is that the default browser does not support the download from the site which i am going to show you the default uh, digipad browser doesn't open the website properly and there is no download option as well so make sure you have the firefox browser <clears throat> so once you get the firefox browser uh, after that i'm going to show you the url address which you need to type in into the browser so that you can download the visualization app for your digipad and that visualization app uh, url address is going to be bit.ly slash two capital h y number eight four capital b and a small a so this is the url address of the visualization app download uh, website so bit.ly slash 2hy84b and small a so this is the address once you type in this address just click on the go button and let's just wait for the web page to load so as you can see the web page has loaded uh, and i have made it extremely convenient for you and uh, there's a straight away download button right in the middle of the page which you can click and download and you can see the it, uh, the app written is a visualizer by travel tech so once you get this web page open so make sure you click on the blue color download button right in the middle of the screen and wait for the download to begin Now, once you click on the download button, it is going to ask you a dialog box asking you uh, when to use this uh, dialog downloader in order to in download the stuff from the internet. So you can click always, but rather click on just once because in case you need to change something in the future, just once would be useful. So just click on the just once button and wait for the download to begin. And how to confirm if the download is happening? Just drag down in the window from the top and let's just wait for the download to begin. So as you can see, the download has completed. So once there is a confirmation regarding the download being completed, so once the download is completed and you have clicked on it, you will be greeted with this uh, uh, page where it, it is going to ask you to install the application. So just click on the install button down here and wait for the app to get installed. So the app is installed properly in the digipad right now. So it will show as application installed and it's going to give you an open and done button. So may, you know, just go and click ahead on the open button. So when you click on the open button, it is going to take you directly into the settings section of the visualization app. So this is a setting section which I had shown you previously. So you will directly go into this. So once you reach this page, you can immediately set it at your, as your live wallpaper. But if you want to customize it a bit, you can go down and customize it according to your convenience and according to your preference. So I just wanted to show you a one small change which you can make in your uh, visualization app. Previously, which I had shown the snowfall effect. Now you have to scroll down into the particles section. And as you can see, there is an option for enabling particles and particle theme. So if you disable the particles, the snowfall will stop completely and only the visualization will be happening. So if you enable it, the particles will fall and the snowfall effect is going to happen. And the second effect which I needed to show you is the outer space effect. There is an outer space effect. So what happens is uh, the screen, the visualization will look like it is going through a stream of stars in the space and it will give you a star trip, uh, star trek kind of an appearance. So it's also a very nice appearance. So I just show you the outer space effect right now. So I just clicked on it. So let me just view it and show you a demonstration of how the this uh, star outer space effect is going to work. So as you can see, the, it's, it looks like as if we are moving through the stars and the car is moving through the stars and especially at night this is going to look very nice and the visualization is also here. And this is how and I have shown you exactly how to adjust the visualization as well. You can change the degree to which the, it is angulated. You can change the horizontal vertical position. You can zoom in, you can zoom out through these control buttons. So once you have done that, just make sure you click on the set as live wallpaper button and head back to your home screen. And there you go. The visualization is running and the outer space effect as you can see is also running. So congratulations, you have the visualization app in your digipad and from now on whenever you hear music just go back to your home screen and see the digipad screen light up the music in such a beautiful manner. 
so this is the way this is the method to in order to download and install the visualization app for the digital the speedometer app the downloading and installation process is very much similar to this app you need to have the mozilla firefox browser in your digipad so just head to the firefox browser just open the page go to a new tab once you have downloaded uh, uh, the visualization app make sure you go to a new tab so once a new tab is open go ahead and click the url address which i am going to show you right now and that url address is going to be bit.ly slash number three small letter p and a number one that will be followed by capital j then seven and then capital f and r so this is the url address it's bit.ly slash 3p1 capital j number 7 and a capital f r so when you type this address just click on the go button and wait for the google drive page to load so if your internet connection is really fast it is going to open up very soon and make sure you uh, read this name on top that is the digital display by travel tech and once you reach that there is a download button right in the center of the screen so just click on this download button and wait for the download to begin so as you saw previously it is going to ask you a dialog box so just click on the just once button so just scroll down and uh, you can see the download already has completed so just click on the download complete dialog box so once you click on that it is going to ask you to install the application so go ahead and install the app so now the app has been installed so just go ahead and click on the open button so there you go you have the digital speedometer the futuristic display of the digipad right in your car right now so this is the process you need to do in order to download and install the app directly onto your digipad if you want you can side load, side load it uh, from your smartphone or laptop but that is the cumbersome process i said and it's a not such a convenient process because you have to transfer the files to your sd card transfer it to pen drive again put it in the digipad again go to the file manager that takes a lot of process you can directly do that through this and uh, when you do this this is a very easy process you don't have many more things going on and it will it will happen in a very simple and a easy manner for you to do so as i showed you yesterday the center dial it's looking very nice it's showing the speed and here is the compass and here is the gps it shows the elevation right here and here is a trip recording and here is a temperature which is 20 degrees right now and uh, the weather it is showing as scattered clouds and there is a date and day so all this will come to your digipad and once you start using this uh, you, it, it, this digipad is going to look very alive it's looking to it's going to look very amazing so this is the way guys this is how you download and install both the visualization app and the digital display app for your digipad so uh, as i told you before earlier i have two small requests make sure you take some photographs or take some videos and put them on the whatsapp groups or facebook groups so that everyone else can also find out about this and get their get it in their digipads and start using them as well and my second request is that go to this video go to the comment section of this video and just write in the three comments i love travel tech if you really like the stuff which i'm doing and if you really like the both the apps which i have bought you till now uh, both the apps which i have brought you this week so if you like that if you like the effort behind it just go to the comment section write i love travel tech and also below if you want to add something extra to that comment you can also write in continuation of that so this is it guys this is the way to do it so i hope this weekend you go and download and install both these and put up a lot of videos and photos for everyone else to see for everyone's to experience a new digipad which we had never seen before and upgraded a very much efficient and a smart looking digipad which previously it never was and all this because of the your lovable channel travel tech so i hope you guys like this i hope you like uh, like this video also as well and subscribe to my channel for bringing out such interesting content so make sure you don't go away from this video without subscribing make sure you don't go away without liking this video and commenting below what i have already told you so that's it guys i hope you like the content so have a very nice day